Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Okay, today tutorial I'm going to share to you about how to solve simultaneous question. Where uh, this tutorial is the extent from the previous tutorial and it is the third volume about simultaneous question. Okay, uh, so we are going to solve the equation where x minus y equal to six and y equal to x squared minus seven x plus ten. Okay, for the first, uh, we need to uh, re uh, we need to rename the equation as uh, equation one and equation two. Okay, for the step one, we uh we solve equation one and find y. Okay, so x minus y equal to six. So we bring uh we make y positive, so become uh y equal to x minus six. And uh, x minus six is a uh, equation three. Okay, and then step two, we substitute equation three into equation two. So we just substitute y equal to x minus six. Okay, so y equal to x minus six equal to x square minus seven x plus ten. Okay, and then uh, and then we arrange the equation and. We make uh, equal to zero and we solve the equation so we get x square minus uh, x plus 16 equal to zero okay so we get equation four okay and then for step three we find x using equation four so x x square minus 8x plus 16 equal to zero so we use calculator or calculate manually so we get x minus 4 x minus 4 equal to 0 so x minus 4 equal to 0 so x equal to 4 okay and then we uh, for step 4 we substitute x into equation 3 in order to find y where the x equal to 4 so we just substitute x equal to 4 so we get y equal to 4 minus 6 so we get y equal to negative 2 so we get the answer x equal to 4 and y equal to negative 2. Okay, and then for the next question, we solve the simple equation uh, uh, 3x plus y equal to 3 and 2 over 3x plus 1 over y equal to 2. So we uh, name the equation as equation 1 and equation 2. And then for step one uh, is same as before solve equation y and find y and then 3 x plus y equal to 3 and then we make y as subject so we get 3 minus 3 x so we get equation 3 okay and then step 2 we substitute equation 3 into equation 2 so we just substitute y equal to 3 minus 3 x so the equation is 2 over 3x or plus 1 over y equal to 2. So, you write 2 over 3x plus 1 over y. So, y 3 minus 3x. So, equal to 2. Okay. And then, we are going to uh, uh, equalize the denominator. So, we, uh, we multiply uh, 3 minus 3x over 3 minus 3x. And uh, multiply 3x over 3x. So we just uh, multiply. So we get 6 minus 6x plus, three, uh, um, plus 3x. So and then uh, equal to 2. Okay. And then uh, we simplify the equation. Okay. 6 minus 6x plus 3x over 9x minus 9x squared equal to 2. So we solve the equation. So we get 6 minus 3x over 9x minus 9x squared equal to 2. So we bring the numerator 9x minus 9x squared to the right. So we get, so it become multiply. So we solve the equation. So we get 18x squared minus 21x plus 6 equal to 0. So we divide by by 3. We get 9x squared minus 7x plus 2 equal to 0. So we get equation 4. Okay, and then for the step 3, we find x using equation 4. So 
equation four is uh six x square minus seven x plus two equal to zero. So we use the calculator. So we get three x minus two, two x minus one equal to zero. So uh, three x minus two equal to zero. So x equal to two over three and two x minus one equal to zero and x equal to one over two. So we get x equal to two over three or x equal to one over two. So for the next step, we set it to x into equation three in order to find y. So y equal to three minus three x. So we just set it to x equal to over three. So three minus three multiplied to over three. So we get y equal to one. Okay, and then uh x equal to one over two, and y equal to three minus three multiplied one over two. So we get y equal to three over two, and then so we get x equal to two over three, and y equal to one, and x equal to one over two, and y equal to three over two. Okay, and then for the next question, we need to solve the symmetric equation where the equation is 3x plus y plus 7 equal to 3x squared plus x minus 2y equal to 4. So, we need to, uh, we need to make new equation. So, we make 3x plus y plus 7 equal to 4. And 3x square plus x minus 2y equal to 4. So we get equation 1 and 2. Okay, and then for the next step, uh, we solve the equation 1 and find y. So y is subject. So we get that is 3 minus 3x. Okay, and then for the next step, step 2, uh, we are going to substitute equation 3 into equation 2. So we just substitute. So the equation is 3x squared plus x minus 2y equal to 4. So we just substitute y equal to 3 minus 3x equal to 4. So we solve the equation. So we get 3x squared plus 7x plus 2 equal to 2 equal to 0. So we get equation 4. Okay, and then for the next step, we find x using equation 4. So, we use just use a collector. So, we get 3x plus 1 and x plus 2 equal to 0. So, 3x plus 1 equal to 0. So, we get x equal to negative 1 over 3 and x plus 2 equal to 0. So, we get x equal to negative 2. So, we get x equal to negative 1 or negative 2. Okay, and then for the next step, uh, we need to substitute x into equation 3 in order to find y. So we get x negative 1 over 3 and x equal to negative 2. So we just substitute uh, into the uh, equation. So we get y equal to negative 2 and y equal to 3. Okay, and then for the next question, uh, x over 2 minus y over 3 plus 1 equal to 0 and 2 over x plus 3 x minus 5 over 6 equal to 0. Okay, for the first step, uh, it is just same step uh, as uh, the as just same step. Okay, so we just find and simple simplize equation 1 and equation 2. So, x minus 2 minus y over 3 plus 1 equal to 0. So, we bring uh, positive 1 equal uh, to the right. So, we get negative 1. So, we need to uh, equalize the numerator. So, we multiply with 3 over 3 and 2, my, 2 over 2. Okay. And then, um, we simplify the question. So, we get 3x minus over 6 minus 2y over 6 equal to 1. So, we get the question 1, 3x minus 2y equal to 6. Okay, and then for the next question, uh, same. Uh, we might uh, equalize the denominator. Okay, and then we simplify. Okay, and then we get 
uh, and then uh, we bring 6 to the left and we multiply so we get the equation 2 Okay, and then for the step 2, we solve equation 1 and find x. So, equation 2 is uh, 3x squared, my 3x minus 2y equal to 26. And we simplify and find x. So, we get 2y minus 6 over 3. Okay, and then for step 3, we substitute equation 3 into equation 2. So, we... We just substitute, so we just substitute x equal to 2y minus 6, uh, minus 6 over 3, and, okay, and then, okay, it think it multiply with x, uh, which is the x is uh, 2y minus 6 over 3 plus 12y equal to 5 multiply 2y minus 6 over 3 and multiply with y, okay, and then, 18, uh, we 3, we divide, so we get 6. Okay, and then 6 multiplied with 2y minus 6 plus uh, 12, y equal to 10y minus 30 over 3, multiply y. Okay, and then we bring uh, 3 to the left and then we become multiply okay and then we just uh, multiply uh, 3 with 12 so we get 36y minus 108 plus 36y equal to 10y square minus 3 30y and then we just simplify the equation and then uh, we divide the equation with 2 so we get 5y square minus 51y plus 54 equal to 0 so we get equation 4 so the next step we find y using the equation 4 so you we just need use calculator so we get y minus uh, so we just use calculator okay and then uh, y minus 9 uh, 5 y minus 6 equal to 0 so we get uh, y equal to 9 and y equal to 9, y equal to 6 over 5. Okay. Okay, and then uh, for the next step, we substitute uh, y into equation 3 in order to find x. Okay, and then uh, when y equal to 9 and Okay, and the equation is x equal to 2y minus 6 over 3. So, we just substitute y equal to 9. So, 2 min multiply 9 minus 6 over 3. So, we get uh, 4. Okay, and then when y equal to 6 over 5 and x equal to 2y minus 6 over 3. So, we just substitute 6 over 5. So, we get x is equal to negative negative uh, 6 over 5 so we get x is equal to 4 y equal to 9 and x is equal to negative 6 over 5 and y equal to 6 over 5 okay guys that's all thank you guys for watching and please uh, like subscribe and if you have any question, just uh, leave your comment below. Alright, thank you.